The victim, late Ebifemine Ogudobiri, a security man, was arrested in November last year by policemen of the A Division in Asaba. He was in police detention for days before he died in controversial circumstances. The remains of Ebifemene, father of four, were deposited at Federal Medical Center, Asaba. Investigations showed that when the family of the victim insisted on autopsy, the police attempted to secretly conduct the autopsy without the presence of the family. However, the management of the Federal Medical Center insisted that family members of the deceased must be involved before they will release the body. The result of the autopsy has however revealed that the victim did not die by hanging. An uncle to late Ebifemene, Kwale Keme Kletus, reacts. The division turned an info to the command that the boy died. He complained of a minor headache and he was rushed to a police clinic and he died. And in their corona form, where the autopsy report is, it said the body was seen hung in the toilet within the cell. For the interpretation of the autopsy report, indicates that it was a stage managed angle. Reacting, lawyer to the deceased family, barrister Michael Ororo, expressed the light that the pathologist has revealed a lot on the death of the deceased. He wondered why the police gave contradictory statements in respect of the death of Ebifemene by claiming initially that the victim complained of headache and died on arrival at the police clinic, only to claim later that the victim hanged himself in the cell toilet when the family insisted on autopsy. He, however, frowned at the police reluctance to take action since the autopsy result was released. Examination or the medical report from the pathologist has revealed a lot about the cause of the death of the young man. Now, since then, we have been waiting for action on the part of the Nigeria Police Force, particularly the Delta State Command. Now we have waited and nothing has been done. And uh, we need to take some steps because the matter involves a human life. Efforts to obtain comment from the police was unsuccessful as the Delta State Police Commissioner declined to speak on the issue. The police is yet to forward the result of the autopsy and other documents to the Director of Public Prosecution for necessary action. Dave Obaro reporting.